Joshua Coleman Growth. On a day-to-day -day basis, our job as medevac pilots is very similar to what you would think of as a civilian firefighter. We work on a um, on-call status, so we're on 24-hour shifts, and we, uh, on a regular morning, wake up, go out to the aircraft. We make sure that everything is all set and ready to go, so that in the event that we actually do get a mission that comes down, we are on on top of everything and able to get out to the aircraft and get off the ground as quick as possible to be able to arrive on scene and provide that care to the patient with uh, as little delay time as possible. We are able in our position to give those people that are willing to sacrifice for me, for my family, for my country, we are able to give them the support that they need so that they have the confidence to be able to go out and properly execute their mission. And there's no other job that I would rather do, do than this and nothing that has brought me more satisfaction than being a medevac pilot. All the desires that I've ever had to serve as a medevac pilot. Uh, my dad, when I was growing up, was a crew chief. He was a, a guy that, that uh, took care of the aircraft. He was an onboard mechanic, essentially, for the aircraft um, and was a medevac crew chief for over 20 years as I was growing up. And there's nothing that I wanted to do more as a, as a kid growing up than to be a pilot in the United States Army and fly medevac. Um, I'm just grateful for the opportunity that I've been given to be here to be able to do that and help other people that otherwise may not have survived. My grandfather served, my great-grandfather served, uh, all of my great uncles served, my father served. I have lots and lots and lots of family that, that has served in the military and I just knew that that's what I wanted to do and that's the direction that my life was gonna go. I wanted to, to do my part uh, on the ground with the idea and understanding that eventually I would uh, continue to pursue my goal of becoming an officer and ultimately becoming an Army aviator and fly medevac.